Goodness, right in the pool. that you're dealing with here is quite an annoying uh, scale. with the bite. for sure. Definitely makes them stronger. So truly fallen? I would assume so. My demise to be that of an honorable knight. What 
did this thing open? All of these things are open. I love that, like, little shotgun blast. Just knocks them all for a loop. No more heals. Once again, big problem with the, uh... the balancing of this game don't give you many heals and they don't give you very many heals and they don't recharge your heals very often this is an insane balancing issue even in Dark Souls, you at least get 10 points. of things, not even the castle could protect them. Quite unfortunate. Right, like, where's the respite? Come on, give me a respite. Seriously. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, 
<laughs> I seriously don't want to, like, give you any sort of benefit. Exhausting. Come on. Now you have to go all the way back. person who's like, oh, you know, it'd be fun having them have to traverse the same stuff many, many times. No heals, just constant enemy spam. I'm sure that they're going to find it the most enjoyable thing they've ever done. A good game. Just suffer from so many balancing issues. Where's the freaking respite? This book. In order to defend the Twin Spires, we Knights of the Bastion took the Odd Elixir and became immortal today. I would much prefer if we didn't have to rely on forbidden magics, but even if it must, if it means making ourselves undead, we must protect our great nation. Even when stained with blight, a knight must never lose pride in their duty. Over, the kingdom is done for. Julius. And where does that go? It goes down to that area. Let's, let's take a quick yeah. Ooh. Cade Crown. Will be more easily stunned by attacks. Why do I have, like, strong doubt? They're going to be, like, more easily deterred in pretty much any way at all. Be more easily stunned by attacks. Let's see. 
Well, let's see how much easier they will be stunned by attacks. seem a little bit easier to stun them, but it doesn't seem like it would make that much of a difference anyway. that horsey.
piercing. get <laughs> whatever it is it helps me unlock these things here seems like i must because respite imagine that be the throne room ahead yeah long last, the abominable lord of the blighted lands has been purified. Beside myself, wrapped with rapt relief. The blighted have tormented us for many long years, but now I control them. Tied as my hands were, I had no choice but to afflict my subjects to deal with those dangnable wretches. Now their power is in my hands. And I am a power-greedy king, as all kings should be. All right, let's see. Um, eh, not bad, not bad. Settle. Let's see how bad the fight is first. King of Land's End. Dead. Ooh. Got a big ol' spear. So not too bad. Captain Julius.
seriously, all that and none of it was getting through? None of it? At all? Nothing? Makes no sense. push, but I guess. Here, real quick. Hey. King of the First Ages Diary number two. The ancients have put fierce Fight, although our army outnumbers their own, they command a force of immortal warriors born of some ancient art. These deathless ones, who have already forfeited their mortal coils, can, cannot be killed. It seems they can only be contained through magical means. Ten days have passed since the battle began, and there is no end in sight. Yeah, sounds like a personal problem. is absolutely frustrating. Get out of the way! Holy freak! Oh my goodness.
with that <laughs> I'm sorry I've only added to your burdens yeah you're freaking annoying that's your problem <laughs> as the kingdom approached oblivion its subjects became deathless abominations my brethren fought on until madness consumed them or the rain did I managed to stave off the corruption of my mind and found myself in the throne room. My blade held over the king I was meant to protect. He shook and blubbered in exasperation. Priestess and knights who gave their lives for the kingdom were disposable. This was where the king's obsession with immortality had led us. King's words, dripping with greed, were the palpable lament of his corrupt heart. It was plain to me as the blood pumping in my heart also flowed through my veins. I too had not fought to protect the kingdom nor its people, but my own interests. I only wished for him to admit he had been wrong to abandon me. Fair enough, as I held my sword over him, his eyes were fixed only on me. I found that crown been waiting for this, waiting for our eyes to meet for the very first time. Hmm, unfortunate. Knight Captain Julius unleashes a series of stabbing attacks with a lance that allows for maximum reach. Lancing thrust can be made using the skill while moving sideways. The king's illegitimate son, after enduring a hard life, he rose through the knightly ranks to get back at his father. Oh. Grabs hold of you and charges forward, allowing for a burst of momentum. Oh. Well, that's interesting. Oh. Piercing Spectral Lance. Less chillin' walls. The longer the dash, the more magic builds up with the spear. It not only increases attack range and power, but also powers through thicker pestilent walls. Ooh. A knight driven from his castle. How much hatred must be consumed by to kill one's own kin. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. Today we've been doing dumb stuff.